football, baby. I'm prime time, and it's time to announce the NFL way to play recipient. This is the honor that goes to the guy who exemplifies proper technique. Now, in week eight, we got a guy who did his thing, and he's going to receive a personal letter from the commissioner, as well as a $2,500 donation to the player's high school or youth program of his choice. The winner for week eight is... Jonathan Jones of the New England Patriots. Now, here's the thing. You know how I feel about tackling. You only got to do it when you need to do it. And here, he needed to do it. Let's check out this play. Now, Nick Chubb, he was cooking in this game. He was doing this thing. You'll check him out right here. He's going to have a run and come down the left sideline. And at the moment of him breaking away, you're going to think he's going to score. Take a look at Jones back here, though. He's going to actually fall down, okay. and then he's going to pick himself up. Now, watch how, how Nick Chubb breaks away to the left sideline. Check out the effort at the top of your screen. He's tracking Nick Tubb, tracking Nick Tubb, and then he just punches that ball out last minute. This is old school. This is like the peanut punch. And he comes, wraps the left hand around, right arm, drills through the ball, it pops out. This is how you become a historic defense. They give up big plays, but they don't give up the biggest ones in the game. And Jonathan Jones, he is the way to play recipient for week eight. I can appreciate that because he could have tracked him down. He could have cut him low. He could have went after his legs, ankles, knees. Nah, he got the tackle and he got the ball back for his team. And that is the way to play. So congrats to Jonathan Jones and the award, the $2,500 donation. Nice. That will be made in his name. We can't wait to find out who will be the way to play recipient next week week. Now, here's a guy that's always balling, so I'm always calling. Hey. Listen, here, here I'll, I'll give you one of my quotes. Uh -uh, uh, 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 water covers two-thirds of the earth. Will Selva covers the rest. <laughs> yeah, Prime. Yeah. I like it. Well done. Well done. Now, that is an intro. Well, the Astros scheduled Texans quarterback Deshaun Watson to yell, play ball before Game 7 of the World Series in Houston. It turns out he didn't do it, and just as well, the Astros lost to the Nationals. Sorry, Houston. But in actuality, what prevented Watson from doing it is his injured eye. Staying out of the light is something that will help heal it. He suffered the injury in Sunday's win over the Raiders when he was kicked in the eye. The Texans face the Jaguars this Sunday in London, and Watson plans on playing. Well, Chargers spent some time this week honoring veterans at the Veterans Hospital in Long Beach. Chargers players went room to room, spending time with the vets as part of the team's salute to service. The NFL's year-round effort to honor, empower, and connect with our nation's service members, veterans, and their families. And staying on the topic of the Chargers, they'll get a visit from Aaron Rodgers and his impressive stash. In fact, he's inspired his counterpart, Philip Rivers, to grow a little lip lettuce of his own. I can't I can't compete with his mustache that's for sure uh, or many guys for that matter we'll see how long it lasts I usually don't make it very long